I think it went good. I mean, we got another opportunity to come out here and, you know, get on the field again. I mean, it felt good. It was like the first day of school or something. You got that, you know, little stomach feeling. It felt really good. Mechanically, what were they working on with you today? Uh, just working the fundamentals of the offense, and this is my first time being able to go through the stuff uh, that we've been working on in the, in the meeting rooms and stuff. So I think that went really good. Just getting out there for the first time, you know, everything's a little different. You got different teammates. You got you know different cadence. I'm under the center every well, not every play, but a lot of the time, and it's just understanding the difference. How, how do you feel the process has been as far as like going from Zoom to actually on the field executing the things that uh, Pat O'Hara wants you to do? I feel like they're two totally different things, but they're not outside of what you're able to do. You you can do whatever you put your mind to. You can do whatever you want to put the time in and the work in to get to. So it's just up to whoever's doing it. So I feel like, you know, you put the time in after whatever we meet on and go work on it and grind on it, then you'll be able to do it. But like anything else, when you come out here for the first time and do something, it's going to be a little different. So you just got to continue to work and take each day as its own. When the snaps were getting loose, what, what, what was going on there? How'd you, how'd you fix it? And how much work do you guys have to do on that? That was just a little, a little some, you know. It wasn't nothing too much. I wouldn't fret over that. But uh, we were working on that. We were working on that. Uh, just a little different from, like I said, I play under the gun most of the time in college, and I'm not gonna really gonna get too much into scheme. But uh, it's a little different here, so I just got to understand that and get used to it. Is that something that you worked? Is that something that you worked on all between the end of your college season and? prior to the draft was working under center and working on seven step drops and things like that? Yeah, we were definitely working under the center, but at the end of the day, these are new people. I got new teammates, so it's not the same center I had been working with for the past few months. So it's understanding new teammates and building that rapport and getting those snaps here, wherever we may get those reps in. It's just, you know, getting those reps. It's first day, we got a long, we got a long way to go. Today with, with Pat out there, what, what kind of stuff are you trying to work on or, or you know improve there? I mean, footwork is key to a quarterback, so we're just working on the fundamentals of the position and just going through reads and whatnot and understanding what comes with that as far as that goes. Malik, more of a background question. I know in, in the past people maybe have wanted you to play different positions. I guess why was your conviction always so strong in wanting to be a quarterback? Because, I mean, sometimes it's always like, you know, you got somebody that plays receiver or plays safety or plays something that you could put at quarterback and win. But I was the opposite. I was a quarterback that could play other stuff. So I, I never really felt the need to want to go play, you know, receiver or DB or something. I was a quarterback, you know what I mean? So it's not really a conviction. It's a identity. It's what I am, you know what I mean? What's your interaction been like with maybe some of the veterans who are meeting you for the first time and maybe maybe Ryan in particular? Oh, it's been cool. I mean, he had us over the house the other day. We ate. I mean, I don't know why they was doing all that. I don't know. I don't know. But uh, they cool, dude. Um, all my teammates cool. They they all opened up to us, uh, all our rookies. Uh, yeah, they had us over there and just gave us a little bit of game and just what comes with this process. Uh, just tell you, keep your heads up and know that a lot of work took uh, took place in order to, for them to get where they're at. So that's what it's going to take for us as well. You say, you say Ryan had, had you over. Who else do you have over the house? Yeah, all the offense. Offensive skill. I was made Malik about, about Ryan's comment about not mentoring earlier. What comment? What's that? What comment? Ryan Tannehill. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What, uh, did, you, did you take anything from that or, you know, anything of significance or, or what are your thoughts? Oh, man, we chopped it up. I mean, he, it was never anything negative. Ryan's a good dude, and he had us, like I said, he had us over the house. Everything's cool, man. I have a question for you. Look, just with, you know, this first time seeing you in person, obviously, for a lot of us, have you always had the body type of just, I mean, have you built that over the years? Or I'm just curious as to where the, that it all comes He's saying, I look so old. I yeah, appreciate it. I, mean, I, I mean, I just got to get a glory to God on that one. You pray like it's up to God, you work like it's up to you. And I just try to go out every day and try to get better, whether it's on the field or in the weight room, just any aspect of my life. So I, I, I'm going to give it to him every time. It seems like he had a lot. a lot. Ever since you were drafted to, to learn the Titans offense, how much did you see the work you put in ahead of time pay off in the field today? Shoot, sure, I've seen it a lot. I mean, I was a lot better than what I thought it was going to go like. You know, you go through something for the first time, you don't know what to expect. And, you know, everybody put their opinions out about what they think, but don't nobody know until you go through it. And I was just really, really appreciative of Coach Pat and Coach Todd and just preparing us in order to get out there and just go have fun and play the game that we love to play. Oh, 
I felt really good about it. it looked like you did some work on progressions. Um, how'd that go? How limited was that at Liberty compared to what, what we're told, and how much do you have to gain there? I mean, I don't know what you were told. <laughs> but I think, you know, progressions are a part of quarterback play wherever you're at. So I just felt like you get to different ones uh, at this level. And like I said, you with a new team and new people, so you just got to get used to it. So it's going to take work. With this team being so based off of QB movement, like how much do you think that really will accentuate what you do well? Mm, I don't know if it's based off QB movement. I think this is just the Titans offense, you know what I mean? That's just first day stuff. We got a whole offense, you know what I mean? Uh, we just running the Titans offense. We running what they install every day, and we go out there and practice what we do in the meeting room. That's all. It seemed like you had a lot of questions for Pat along the way, too. How impatient, I guess, are you to sort of, you know, learn this thing as quickly as possible? Uh, I'm, I feel like I am patient in order to, you know, very, very like much prepare myself. I mean, without preparation, you never feel comfortable. You never feel like you're able to go do your best. I just want to take every day like this my last and just learn as much as I can, retain that information, and go out there and try to do it the next day. You get a chance to say anything to Traylon? Uh, seemed like he had a tough day and wasn't able to be out yeah, there. Yeah, that's all good. He good. Uh, that's my roommate too, so I'm gonna chop it up with him. No. We like about his game oh, and maybe how special it will be for you guys to kind of grow together. Uh, you know, starting starting this weekend? I think it's really cool that we got our whole rookie class out here and, you know, it's just us for a minute so we can all get used to, you know, Titans football and whether that be on offense or defense. And I just feel like it's really cool that we all get to spend this time together and grow as players. You know, we're in these meeting rooms together. We're all growing. We're all competing. But it's the first time for all of us. So I feel like that's really cool. Hey, what the coach has kind of told you about on the first day, I know you want to make a good impression, but it's a, it's a long journey and just kind of take your time. What were they told you about that? Hey, we got 1% each day. That's all we're trying to get. In 100 days, you'll be 100% better. That's what he told me, so it's all good. We're just going to work every day. Kind of along those lines, Malik, what do you expect out of yourself as you kind of embark on this, this journey? I just expect myself to come to work every day as long as God wake me up, you know what I mean? And just come out here and enjoy myself and try to be the best player I can be and fight through the mistakes, fight through the successes. I mean, either way it goes, you got to stay cool, cool, calm, cool, and collected. I messed up right there. <laughs> Learn the call, calm, cool, collected attitude because it's kind of how you come across. It's not a bad thing. Yeah, I mean, life really. I mean, it's a game at the end of the day. I mean, it's a very important game to a lot of people, but it's a game at the end of the day. You go through way worse stuff in life, and you have to understand that. And you got to be able to be resilient as a person outside of football. So I feel like when it comes to football, you just got to be strong minded and understand it's not your identity. Yeah, and I feel like you're supposed to use this platform for something. Like, I use it for God. Other people use it for whatever charity they want to do. So, uh, at that, I don't know. That's, that's how I feel about it. I don't know. My bad.